a beer with Eduardo. Hey, welcome to another episode of A Beer with Eduardo. I am your wonderful host. Once again, here I am, Eduardo. We are, um, if you like this show or if you like what I'm doing, please uh, like the video, uh, ring the little bell thing, ring it, ring it, ring it, and subscribe to the show so that we can kind of grow and find an audience. Uh, otherwise, this effort on my part is somewhat wasted. So there is some information out there about the, uh, the Brewers Advent Calendar that I'll uh, be happy to kind of read for you at some point. We'll, we'll do that at the end of the thing um, at the, what, when we're finished. Right now, today, we're on to episode tw- or beer number 22. So there's three remaining. There'll be two after this. So on the 24th one, I'll give you like the big reveal um, or we can talk about that on the program. So this one, and I like the, uh, the artwork on this one. It's simple, but it's nice. It's got the little, the crown and the little uh, dogs or tigers or whatever uh, deal on the front. This is uh, Schlau. Schlobbrow or Schlockbrow, Schlofbrow Reader, original Pilsner, and it is a product of Germany. So, and let's take a look here. It says since uh, 1686, and where we are. This is a 4.7 alcohol by volume, and it's a Schlossbrow Reader Pilsner. So that is what we're we're dealing with here today. Let's uh let's get it on open and get it in my glass. Shall shall we? So we are getting close to the end of the the case. Then after that, I'm going to actually move on to other beers. I've uh I've got a Guinness going to be coming up. And so you'll get to experience that with me if you've had Guinness before and you either you either like it or you don't like it. Uh, my memory of it is that I didn't care for it. So it may still be that way. I have had some darks throughout the process of doing this. So uh, I do like some of the dark beers, but Guinness is an extra dark, almost black beer. And uh, it is definitely... I think it's something that I'm, it's going to take a, a certain taste that I don't necessarily maybe have. So give it a little smelly smell. It smells like beer. Okay, let's have a drink. Almost, a, there's a little bit of a a sweet flavor to it. I could, I mean, really, I could be having, like, some sort of heart issue or a stroke, and maybe it doesn't taste sweet at all. Half the time, I think these people that go on and write the reviews that give more intimate details, I think they're kind of pulling stuff out of their ass. Maybe not, but uh, for me, this is, I mean, this is a def- definitely a decent beer. I'd say it's sessionable, of course, naturally. Let's, uh, let's take a look, though, and see if we can find out some more information over at beeradvocate.com. How's that sound to everybody here today? All right, so here's some information on the beer we're drinking today. Number 22, uh, Schloss Brewery Reader Original Pills. So, uh, it has a average of 3.55 out of 5 rating with a 81% score or score of 81, which is good. Let's see what HMAN43 has to say. HMAN43 has been here before. He's written some reviews that I've not necessarily agreed with or disagreed with. 
Uh, he says that it pours yellow and clear with a slight bit of haze. It is a white head. Head retention is very good. Taste is, has a grainy sweet aroma with a bit of apple. So I did, I picked up the sweetness. I did it. Okay, we're done here. I got it. I'm, I'm a beer. I'm an expert now. So we'll see you later. Just kidding, guys. We're going to finish this beer today. All right? So anyway, uh, feel it. Light body with a sweet finish. I, I could pick that. I picked that up. So overall, your taste is thrown a bit by a metallic element herb. And an herb with some sweetness. So there's that. Let's see. And he gave it a 3.06 out of 5. So there's that for you. Let's take a look and see what somebody else has to say here really quick. All right. So appearance, medium golden color with some haze. The head is snow white coarse and modest. See, I think these guys just copy each other. So like, he's like, it has some haze. Yeah, yeah, it does. It sure does have some haze. And it's got a head, and it's white, and uh, let's see, uh, this guy says it's got herbal, yes, yeah, so herbal and metallic. I, I taste the metallics and the sharp bitterness. Yeah, yeah, me too. Sharp bitterness and metallics. Yeah, you know it. I, heck yeah, buddy. All right, anyway, I'm done. Uh, <laughs> so... That is just, that's the information that I have here. So here's, here's another one. Light yellow, clear, large. Uh, okay. Hey, lacing, excellent fairy jacket, three-dimensional brands of torn lace curtains. I, okay, so there's a item in my Amazon wish list, and I'm going to pick this up for when we start doing actual, when I move on from the advent calendar to actual beers. And I'm going to start reading it. Um, I'll put a picture of it in the thing here, but I'm going to start getting myself educated a little bit on this whole stuff, on all this beer drinking stuff. So maybe I can kind of understand and not feel like this is kind of a bunch of pretentious bullshit, but uh, we'll, we'll get there after we do the calendar. Let's, uh, let's get this one in the, in the, in the gut belly and uh, finish for this episode. Mm, that's great. It is good. Let's quickly, though, check in with past Eduardo and see what he's up to on the old booba tubaroo. All right. Here he is. Hey, buddy. Oh, hey, man. How's it going? Good. Yeah. Good. I'm doing good. No, it's been a while. It has yeah, been a while. I know. For sure. Well, what you watching? So today I'm actually I'm busy. I'm watching uh, Highway to Heaven. Oh, we'll go, go figure. figure. Yeah. Uh, over. See. Okay. Yeah. Well, let that, me just tell you. Over there in that case. Oh, that right case. There that case is uh, one VHS tape for every for every individual episode of Highway to Heaven. Oh. Recorded on a VCR. commercials and everything. During its uh, Does it have all run, the so it's got commercials and everything. I know. <laughs> oh, it's pretty exciting. Imagine um, that. Yeah, there's not. I'm a, excited. There's not a streaming excited. service that streams that show that I've been able to find. Not, not even Hallmark. Not even Hallmark. No. No. Oh. No. Oh. Uh, you gonna get that? Hang on a second. Hang on. Uh, I gotta take this call. All right, bud. Hello. He's. Oh. Hey, uh, he's got hey, Grandma, how you doing? What's well, Grandma? Yeah, yeah, I love you too. Yeah, it's good to hear from you. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah, no, she I'm just, uh, I'm talking to, I guess, my future self right now. And uh, we're talking about Highway to Heaven. I know, it's a great show. Um, you know, yeah, I'd love to uh, get together and hang out. Um, but I mean, I've got, I mean, okay, so quick question, Grandma. Do you have a uh, cotton candy machine? You don't. Okay, well, I, I don't think this is going to work out. I'll, uh, I'll uh, talk to you later. I'll talk to you later, Grandma. All right. 
All right, bye. Uh, yeah, I, I love you too. Um, think about getting that uh, machine, that cotton candy machine. Well, then we'll talk, okay? All right, bye bye. Sorry about that. No, that's fine. Grandma. fine. How's grandma? How she wanted me to like come spend some time with her, and oh, that's what she just wanted. Not, I mean, it's not the right time for it. So, uh, anyway, okay. Do you want to hang yeah, out I mean, with me sometime? You know, well, do you have a cotton candy machine? I don't. I don't. Well, I mean. Uh, so I don't I, hang out I mean, with it. Unless you have a cotton candy machine. I mean, most people cotton don't. Cotton candy machines make everything a party. Well, well sure. You but then you go to like a carnival. Really talk. Or like a um, sports event or something. Until that time comes. So you don't want to talk to me because I don't uh, have a cotton candy machine. You know, save it for another day, I <laughs> guess. <laughs> okay, Get the cotton buddy. candy machine and we can, we can do business. Oh, we I'll, can do uh, business. I got to get back to business. watching. Business. Uh, Highway to Heaven. Bye. All right, bye. All right. I guess... I guess in order to do business with past me, I have to uh, have a cotton candy machine because that's practical. Just have it right here in the... I, I kind of want a cotton candy machine, if I'm being honest. I love me some cotton candy. I, I'm... I'm follow, yeah. Uh, at some point, I'm going to get me a cotton candy machine. Uh, if we ever monetize these videos, that's like the first thing on my list is cotton candy machine. So anyway, uh, thanks for joining me today. Remember, don't forget to ring the bell, subscribe to the show, give us uh, comments and stuff, and I'll or give feedback in the comments and all that good stuff. And blah 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 blah. blah. Finish the beer and get out of here. Thanks for joining me. Until next time, cheers.